I am by no means the most knowledgeable and successful person in the short form agency space. But I have made a nice bit of money for it in my year of doing it. And every single month, I'm just scaling up and up and up. And I've recently been getting so much DMs from people telling me that they're just starting out and if I have any tips for them. So this video is not for the experts in the niche. This video is for the kings that are just getting started out and want to start making money online. So I'm making this video to show you how you can get started in this ever growing industry. So how did I get into short form marketing? Well, I've always been a video editor since I was a child, starting off making Minecraft videos and then travel videos and then TikToks until eventually I got to this point doing it for other business owners. I never wanted to go to college and wanted to find a way to make money online. So I joined somebody's course, learned all the skills, and this is what I'm doing now. I already knew video editing, but if you don't know video editing, it can be a good thing or a bad thing. I would look at it as a good thing because eventually you're going to have to outsource the work to somebody else. So why not do it from the start? When a client pays you, you find a cheap editor from somewhere like the Philippines and you pay them to edit the client's videos. Then you keep the middle ground profit. That is how it works with most agencies and that's how it's the most scalable. So if you're just starting out, I think right now it's essential to be building a personal brand around your agency. Just like me making these YouTube videos or making TikToks or Instagram Reels, you need to be practicing what you preach. So create videos for your own socials. I had a client tell me that he gets the same outreach message every single day from people getting started in this industry. And what made my message stand out was that I was creating content. I was showing my knowledge. I was showing my previous results on my profile. And that's what got him to sign up. So your personal brand doesn't need to be big to be powerful. The next thing you'd need to know in a short form agency is outreach. How do you get clients? This is the question on everybody's mind. So with outreach, I don't really have a specific script that I use. But I do have a couple of things that I add up to make it the most effective process possible. First of all, personal brand. When doing outreach, they're going to check your profile. If you have nothing on that profile, they're less likely to respond. Number two, being personal with the message. Do not just copy and paste and send it to millions of people. First of all, your account will get flagged. But second of all, they can tell that it's not personal. They can tell that everybody is getting the same exact message. So go onto their profile, check out what they're doing, compliment them on something. The third thing you need to do is give them value. How much value can you give for free before they say they'll hop on a call? This is what you need to figure out. Put those three things in place and you will get a client. Just do the repetition. So number four, we got service delivery. How do you actually serve these clients once you get them? Well, just after outreach, you'd want to get them on a sales call. So I'll do sales first. With sales, you got to show them why your service is so valuable. They're business owners. They should not be spending time editing their own videos. So you can use that. Ask them how much time are they spending on videos? For a lot of people that I talk to, it's way too much time. How much is their time worth to them? Figure that out. And look, sales at the start is a very scary process. Hopping on a call with a stranger, trying to get them to pay for your service. Yeah, it's scary. I remember my first sales call and I was shivering. But once you put in those repetitions again and again and again, it becomes so much easier. And there are so much sales tips out there that you can take and use for yourself. Now, I'm still trying to get better at sales, but you know, it's improving day by day. Now, service delivery. There's a couple of tools that I use to make my client's content process easier number one google drive all my clients upload their unedited footage onto my google drive and they can download the edited footage after it's edited there google drive this is better than whatsapp or anything because if you're using whatsapp to download videos they won't be downloaded in the best quality and with google drive you can keep everything organized and stored with payment i take all my payments over stripe Stripe does take a percentage of all profits, but it's so easy to use that I don't really mind. Now, how do you scale? So when it comes to scaling, you need to be hiring people and putting systems and processes in place. You gotta look at what takes up most of your time in the business and hire that out to somebody who's cheap. 
Since it's an online business, you can hire from anywhere around the world for really cheap. So for me example, the first thing I hired out was video editing. I hired video editors because that's what I was spending the most time on. There's some really talented editors, by the way, that work with me. Shout out to all you guys. And then putting processes in place, automations, communication, use Slack for your clients. And that's a lot of the things I do for my agency and how I was able to scale it a small bit, but you know, I, I'm probably going to make a better video on this. This was just kind of me talking, talking my mind out. If you guys want to learn more about this, then subscribe for more upcoming videos where I'll go through everything in a bit more detail because here I just kind of splatted my mind out onto the screen. So yep, follow along for that. Follow me on Instagram at Luke Histon and I'll see you in the next one.